Hello students, we will learn a problem on C chart today. So they have given a table with the aircraft number and number of missing rivets that is nothing but number of defects in each aircraft. So they are asking us to compute the process average and to compute the control limits for C and to plot the control chart as well as to suggest the value of C dash for the subsequent period. So first of all for the solution total number of aircraft that is being inspected. So here we can see there are 25 aircraft which are being inspected. So let us write it as M that is 25. Then the total number of missing rivets. So here for each aircraft number of missing rivets are given. If you want the total number you have to add up all these. So let us consider this as sigma c that is total number of defects is 351. So that is sigma c that is 351. Now the first a1 that is to calculate the process average. That is C bar. C bar is written as sigma of C divided by M. So that is nothing but 351 divided by 25. So we will get a value of 14.04. So C bar is 14.04. The second point is to calculate the control limits. So what is the formula given to calculate the control limit in C chart? Control limit for C chart is equals to C bar plus or minus 3 into root of C bar. So that is we have found the value of C. Now to calculate the upper control limit. For C chart it is C bar plus 3 into root of C bar. So that is 14.04 plus 3 into root of 14.04. That is nothing but 14.04 plus 11.24 which will give us 25.28. Now the lower control limit is given with the formula c bar minus 3 into root of c bar. So that is 14.04 minus 3 into root of 14.04. So this will give us 14.04 minus 11.24 that is 2.28. process average and control limits c bar is equals to 14.04 then upper control limit for c is 25.28 and lower control limit for c is 2.28 now we have to plot the graph so here i have taken the aircraft number on the x-axis and the number of missing rivets on the y-axis okay so then for the first aircraft what is the c value so c value is 9 so here i have marked it here for the second one it is 16 so it is marked here so in the same way for all the values of the missing rivets on the aircraft corresponding to their aircraft number we will plot the graph. So after plotting the graph I will mark the 
upper control limit and the lower control limit so the upper control limit is 25.28 so let us consider it is as 26 so here the upper control limit lies at the value 26 so it is 25.28 let us consider it approximately 26 and the lower control limit is 2.80 let us consider it as 2 so the lower control limit is 2.80 so approximately let us consider it 2 so we can see that all these points of C or the number of missing rivets are lying within the control limits so the this is the C1 that is plotting of the graph now from the graph D so it can be observed from the start that all the points are lying within the control limits this indicates that this process is under statistical control all the points are lying within the control limits and so we can say that the process is under statistical control so the process average value therefore the process average value that is c bar is equals to 14.02 itself is recommended for future so this is all about the c chart problem i hope you have understood the problem thank you